Hello, hello everyone. It's me, Chaff Commander Coffee, and I'm here with episode 8 of uh, the Game of the Week. Yes, the September 19th Game of the Week, and we are continuing our mad rampage as uh, Germany. Though, mind you, we are coming up to a little bit of a standstill because I can. Well, we saw that there was some. Contemporary era units over here and over here. Well, we've got a siege artillery over there, but oh Yeah, we have a fight over here, too. Yeah, the Battle of Sor Sorotomo. Uh, we should be fine here because they've got four units of winged hussars, which we don't we, we ain't gonna worry about them They're of No concern to us Because the uh, yeah, again the hussars can't do anything here really Uh, we do need to get rid of that siege artillery, though. You guys don't have a shot. Oh, damn, I moved them into the wrong spot. You have a shot there, that's fine, take that. Alright, that siege artillery might break through the walls here, then we'll have a problem. Luckily, they actually built stone walls in the city. So I am going to have to start picking off the uh, hussars. Otherwise, they might get into the city. And if they start getting into the city, then we're gonna have a we're gonna have a bad time. Good firing angles though will keep us in the fight. Right. Uh, we are draining their war support relatively quickly. We have made demands for quite a large swath of territory. So I'm happy about that. Uh, we are going to be attacked here. That's fine. I have a large number of draftees I can throw out to the front. Uh, to eat the initial volleys. Of course, they will get torn apart by... Uh, Gatling gun elephants pretty quickly, but that's fine. They're going to do damage. That's their purpose. There you go. Goodbye, draftees. You served your country well. Well, I guess. I so we'll send the Varangians in as well. Don't know where their uh, artillery went, but that's fine. Can take a shot from here. Alright, we should win this. It's going to be pretty bloody, but we'll win that as well. Got seven uh, reinforcing 
uh, line infantry there. A cat is still building. Yeah, a cat's still building. Oh, let's just do some repeatables quickly. We work on a little another market core. You guys can skip. We have this fight over here. We need to finish up. Can start firing at the uh, siege artillery. I do need to pick off those uh, winged uh, hussar. Uh, there goes one unit. Oh, those guys didn't take their shot. Okay, that's annoying. Alright, Saratomo has been protected. We only lost one unit. That's not too bad. Okay, and that's uh, bringing their war support down quite drastically. These seven line infantry will be able to take Kahuachi. Uh, we have some rebels over here. They're just Oh, okay, there's line infantry there. Right, so we can't lose this fight. Right, there's only one more anti-tank gun, so we can just auto battle the rest of that. More troops coming in. Uh, Tech-wise, we're almost at Encyclopedia, then we will have a Nationhood, and I can start drafting conscripts as well. Uh, but I'm going to have to wait, uh, I think, nine turns for that? Eight turns, okay, eight turns for more, more of those. Velika's built a bunch of line infantry, which I guess I can go take some more tiles with. Go grab Lilliboria. I saw ruined territory over here, so I'm not too worried about that. I guess you guys can come up and grab that tile as well. Nice for us to own more of the map, won't it? And that battle is over. Victory on Kahuachi. We lost all of our Brangians and such, but they weren't, uh, they weren't long for this world. Alright, we have access to coal now, so let's go find where our coal is. Should have a couple of deposits around the Empire. Yeah, there's three deposits there and we're trading for another... Well, I was trading for more. One more there. You have some coal that I can't purchase because I haven't got any money. I'm buying two coal from you, that's fine. Let's get an academy. You don't need stability. Uh, so, more market quarters will do me just fine. Over in Belsner. I'll be able to pay for this army, as I've said many times. These armies are not cheap. Alright, we don't want to take uh, Irreligion. Alright, Science Investing, Overproductive. Let's take Science Investing. Babylon! Let's get an Academy. 
Uh, I guess more market quarters wouldn't hurt. All right, we're forcing them to peace out. We are we are forcing them to give me a territory of Kahuachi. I might as well ask them to. I can't ask them to give me Kahuachi itself. I can force them to give me Euroic. And if I took Kahuachi, I think I could demand that as well. So let's take it. Uh, it is just uh, draftees, so I'll just auto that and let that play off in the background whilst I'm busy doing this. You're going to grab another tile over here. Not the most valuable tiles, there's no resources on them, but... Got an event, overproductive, yep, let's take that. And uh, draftees are coming to get massacred by the line infantry. There we go. And that's the city there. Alright, so we'll be taking that as well. There we go, right. Alright, give me... Kahuachi plus most of its territory. I would like to take Rexina as well. I could choose not to take Euroic and grab like another outpost instead. Yeah, let's do that. Alright, they took Malacca, which is very strange. Kohachi cannot support the uh, population that they have. They also need to clear some ruins. Uh, that's fine. Start clearing ruins. Let's get some uh, coking plants. Okay, put that there. You guys can return to Velsna. Wait, are they pushing a crisis? Okay, we've got a civic I can't do. I just need to set mandatories off for a moment. Alright, I can turn them back on. Nationhood researched, good. Uh, don't need to attach Markeb just yet. Yeah, they don't have like any food coming in. Alright, that should that should solve them for now. Kakab, you can come down. Uh this tile does have obsidian, so I would like to take that tile. Uh could start working on nature reserves. Oh hey. Okay. I could start working on one nature reserve. Got a lot of my cities building things, so I don't need to focus on, um, I need to attach one more tile. Got lots of territories over here. I have a lot of territories over here. Uh, let's set up a new city. And, you know what? I make so much influence, we're going to cancel inherited land and go for communal land. Alright, there we go. And this city should now be able to develop pretty quickly. This is Berlin. All 
All right, that should help with stability. I don't know if that I've got more territories I can. I mean, we're making four thousand influence a turn, which is very nice. Right, I think that was our expansion star for this era. Oh, gold expansion star as well. Very nice. Uh, do we want to farm points? Yeah, we might as well go for a high score. Why not? Let's go for a high score. Uh, I don't like those rebels there. Uh, let's go and grab those mountains. Electricity research, refuse, we're not going to replace that. You guys going to chill there. A CAD needs stuff to do. Let's go get a uh, coal plant. You don't have more coal to trade. You have more coal to trade. No, you don't. You have more coal to trade? You guys? You do not. Do you have any coal to trade? No, you don't. You have more coal. You also have more silk. Hmm. That I would be quite happy to grab. I wouldn't mind buying some gemstones too. But I'd like to buy all those gemstones. Let's take over productive. A 4k influence turn is very nice. It's precisely the sort of thing I need to keep all of my cities working and... Well. It's just what I need to just keep them working, really. Uh, sure, we can put a garrison there. Let's go get a garrison down here, over here. Uh, let's put a garrison in the north. Put a couple up there. Right, you six troops come back to Velika. Okay, we can start increasing our industry some more. More gold coming in. Doing very nicely. Very, very nicely. Alright, Berlin will grow pretty quickly, so I don't need to worry about that so much. I uh, don't really need that hamlet. They need a... <laughs> Oh man, they don't even have a house of scribes. Boy, that city is uh, a little bit in the dark ages. But that's okay, we'll fix it up. No troubles. Right, uh, I, I should take this tile. This is a, a free tile. And attach that to Kawachi. Why can you not work on that coking works? Why is that? Oh, it's because I think there were runes I was trying to clear? I'm not sure. You got more runes to clear? I don't see more runes on the map. Can I see more runes? I don't think I do. Don't think I do. Right, our borders won't look so bad now. Right, you get back into the city. Uh, you can build some nature reserves, sure. Why not? Uh, 
Uh, don't think you'll need a hospital. Go do a couple more um, one turn repeatables. Alright, is it time for us to age up? Could wait for the tech stars. I mean, I don't see a reason not to farm some points. So we'll wait for the tech. Uh, let's finish a symposium, sure. Okay. Uh, that's been taken by rebels. I'm gonna ignore the rebels for now. And since I don't think that's too worrisome for me. Alright, what have we got trade-wise? I have everything I need from you. I have every- well, you don't have anything. Do you want alliance? Uh, for money, refuse. Not paying for that. Oh, I do want your horses. Want your copper. Definitely want your coal. Should probably start buying people's saltpeter as well, because that will help boost our science. Alright, we've got mechanization now, so I can start grabbing uh, sawmills, factories. Which will obviously increase our pollution even further. No, we're not going with that. That's fine. Let's go grab the sawmill and the high furnace quickly. Bountiful, overproductive, let's take Bountiful and take the extra science. It's only 150 points, so it's not that big of a deal, but I'll still grab it. Velika's fixed up most of its infrastructure pretty quickly, which I'm happy about. Working conditions! Money on makers! Oh yes, that's that's what that's what I like to see. That that is a large Cash increase there. Someone to, lift my Someone to lift your spirits, yeah, I hope so. And you're going to lift my economy. I got some copper. Buy that up. Got some salt here for exorbitant prices, but we'll buy it up regardless. Uh, he's breaking my treaties. He made a demand. Declare war with the Egyptians. I don't know why you can demand that, because I'm not your ally, but I'm going to accept that, sure. Now at war with Egypt again. Oh, which is fine, because I have troops right on their borders. Uh, can I bring some troops into that fight? Uh, I could think about it. Uh, I can take Londinia. I should be able to take that as well. Again, we'll just put a uh, line infantry at the front, and you should be able to handle that just fine. Oh, they have Gatling elephants, okay. Oh boy. Well, that I wasn't expecting. Okay, I'm going to need to bring some more troops over to Londinia. Okay, that's going to be awkward. We're going to have to fight siege artillery and such there. Over here, though, this should be relatively simple. Alright, this, this can be auto-battled, because there's only a couple of uh, levies there. Uh, I can raise up... Eight conscripts and throw them at something. Uh, 
like Avaris. Go, my conscripts! Welcome to Germany's power, just being able to go, I have eight gunmen. No, you don't. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. You might not think that's how it is, but that is how it is. Um, I think these guys have an obscene amount of artillery, because I am losing troops here really fast. Oh, they haven't had any tank. Oh, no, they do have a bunch of siege pieces. I'm not even sure we'll be able to hold this for another round. Can attack those draftees. We can we can cut those draftees out, but yeah, I need more reinforcements here. Those artillery pieces are giving me hell. Okay, I can bring seven more troops in next turn, though. Uh, Attil. What is Attil doing? Attil's making me a ton of science. That's what Attil's doing. So, let's work on science here. Workers' rights, condition forced. What, stability on makers? No! No, 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 no. Overlook. No, 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 no. I think not. Uh, we got airstrikes. Are you the Turks? No, you're the Persians in the contemporary, so you just airstriked my outpost down because you're a bastard, I guess. Uh, you have absolutely zero stability. Why is that? Is it because you put another crisis up? No, you didn't. Uh... Is all my trade being blocked? No. How about you guys? You you didn't push a crisis, did you? Okay. Did all my cities just suddenly take a massive stability hit? Or was it just you? I think it's just you because I attached that new outpost. All right. We'll just work on. I think they have too much pollution as well. That might be what's causing that. Oh, yeah, okay, it's pollution. Uh, in fact, can I just build forests on all of these? Uh... We'll reforest everything, that'll solve that. Quickly, forests. Uh, they already have some over there. Alright, these reinforcements should turn the tide of this fight. I can't move them, they're suppressed, so they have to stand there and get shot, I guess. Man, the siege artillery is uh, rough. Is that, is that, that's, I don't think that's even a, no, that is a Gatling Elephant. Okay, well, we're beating them back. It's going to be ex oh, this is an expensive battle. That's an anti-tank gun. So that's a... Uh, anti-tank gun, funnily enough, messes up line infantry just fine. Uh, if we're fighting on poor terrain. So that's a bit awkward. Alright, we need to get our oil hooked up as well now.
I think nature reserves help reduce pollution. I could be wrong, but I think they do. I'm definitely going to have to worry about reforesting places, though. Because apparently, apparently I can't ignore the pollution as much as I used to. Because it's going to... Yep, there you go. Stability is absolutely just caned here. So let's reforest a bunch of stuff. My outpost, no bombing, please. Belsner, uh, you can get some more uh, nature reserves. Uh, there's one dude ransacking that. Can we pop out a line infantry or something quickly? Just to get rid of them. That was a very expensive use of 7,000 gold or how much I just spent there. I think those are, uh, those are line infantry as well. Oh, they're dug in and I can't remove the dug in status. Oh, these line infantry are getting massacred. Sorry about all that. Alright, Londonia is ours. Okay, how's this war going? Very nicely. Alright, let's get our conscripts into the fight. Totally forgot I had these guys over here. There you go. I drafted up a bunch of people and then forgot I had drafted them. That's a very poor uh, management of the Empire there. Right. I think I can auto battle that. I don't think there's much left there for me. Oh, much there for me to worry about. You guys, uh, I think I'm going to burn Malacca. It's going to take four turns, but I will attempt to burn it. I don't think the war's going to last that long. Not especially if I take that. Yeah, I'm taking a Varus now as well. Yeah, the war's not going to last that long. Uh, just skip. Oh, they can keep Malacca, that doesn't bother me. Oh. I am the biggest defender of pollution. Oh boy. Polluting the planet. But like I said, uh, when I was talking about the uh, patch notes, they increased the amount of pollution required by about 2.5 times. Which means that even if you try to pollute the planet, it's incredibly difficult to actually kill it. Although I have been impressed with the AI to keep up with uh, military technology. At least they've done that, you know, with the anti-tank guns and the Gatling elephants and things like... Oh, uh, you know, it's credit where credit's due. At least they're trying, you know. Uh, apparently I need to reforest even more. You need to reforest more as well. Okay. That was a lot of forest we just uh, created. Is that enough to keep pollution down? No, it is not. Because that causes a uh, reduction of stability on all districts. Which, as you can imagine, is a big deal. Uh... Yeah, pollution on every district is... or not pollution, um...
Okay, you guys can chill in Londonia, which I may also capture and see. Surrender to the Persians, surrender to the Italians. Give me 6,000 gold. Give me Malacca and Londonia as well. I could even ask for Avaris too, but we'll just go for Malacca and Londonia. 81k to absorb there. How much to absorb Malacca? 43k. Okay, that's not that's not as bad. Let's just make sure they have, you know, very simplistic infrastructure to make that a bit cheaper. Same with Londonia. Very simplistic infrastructure that they're missing. Yielding to tyranny. Uh, are we the baddies? No, uh, no, uh, no. I always ask myself that when I play 4Xs. It's a recurring theme. I should probably take a hint from that. We might, in fact, be the bad guys. But hey, you know, I'm, uh, it, it, I was protecting my ally, I think. I don't even know why we started that war, but um, somebody crisis it, so... I guess, I guess we were protecting our ally. Alright, uh, let's turn mandatories off again. Cool. And then we turn mandatories back on. Okay, I've got some cities that need things to do. Babylon! Also having problems with that whole pollution deal. Yeah, let's go build some forests out in the Arctic. Some hardcore terraforming going on here. I think I don't think reforesting this much is going to matter, but I think after a certain point, it's just like you have reforested. It ticks a box and goes, "You have done that." Yes. Too bad you still produce too much pollution. I don't know. We'll find out. I think I think that is literally how it's working. We just produce too much pollution. Eight per turn. Next level low pollution at twenty. Okay, that's not. All right, maybe it is working. Maybe it is working. Uh, what's this? Oh, I can't remember what these two do. Uh, it should... There we go. Artist Studio is... Alright, Influence on Research Cores. That's what we want. Right. Uh, do we age up yet? Well, I can age up in a couple of turns. Are you breaking my trade? Do you mind? Do you mind? You better not break the rest of my trade. I'll be very angry. I might even invade you. Which uh, will be more problematic for you than it will be for me. Wait, you want alliance? Yeah, sure, sounds great. Customs union. Sweet, now their goods are cheap. Let's go buy some of their goods, including their coal. Very important to get that coal. Saffron's good, yep. Gold is good, marble's good. Okay, I'll buy their aluminium just because, I'll buy the copper and the iron. More trade routes means more money. Right, that should give us our next merchant star, and then I think that's about time to age up, and we're going into the contemporary, and that is also the end of the episode, guys. So, who do we age up as? It's a good question. There are a total of about 50 turns left. 50 turns. I need to do some serious tech very, very quickly. That means we're going Japan. Oh yes, Japan. If we're going to just uh, turn on science mode, all my cities to get the, those sweet science stars, that's what we want to do. So that's what we'll do. Because um, that's, yeah, that's all I need left, really. So we're going to age up as Japan in the next episode. Thanks for watching, guys. It's been me, Chapman on Coffee. And I'll uh, I'll see you guys in the next episode. I think it'll probably be the last one. The very last. The very final episode of our time. Um, or at least of this game of the week. There'll be more in future, of course. Um, 
It doesn't end here. It just uh, just has a little break. <laughs> right. Take it easy, guys. Have a good one. See you around. Goodbye for now.